Let's see what's going on over this way then, I guess. Oh look, it's fucking... Oh, by the way, I didn't describe, but if I press the bumpers, I do like a weird sidestep for some reason. Because this game needs sidestepping Yorg. combat. Yorg. The third Sprice twin. Why are we just staring at each other? Oh shit, it's one of those bad boys who's been finger painting. Hold your breath. They can't see you if you hold your breath. What? Hurry, like this. Cover your mouth. Yeah, make sure your face is glowing super weird too. Okay. I'm gonna hold my breath too, guys. Fuck, that's- how? Oh my god, I was so close as well! That was so who dumb. Are you? Yeah, who is you? Fuck, man. I was close too. Let me know how far you guys got, holding your breath there. Look at that face! <laughs> oh, that was great. He was- he was a little fucking shitting grin. That was hilarious. Dude. Oh shit, the bed covers are moving themselves. He's under the covers though, guys. That takes a lot. Like, video game animators, they complain the most about the fact that trying to fuck it. Why is it moving around so much? It looks like it's trying to eat him! York, wake up, you're being eaten by your beds! It's, it's consuming you. Look at it, moving around like a fucking pile of flesh. Look at it! It's a fucking Silent Hill monster or some shit. Zack, the symbolism in my dreams continues to intensify. Just wake up with A smoke. forest of red trees. Uh-huh. A carpet with red leaves. Uh-huh. A strange doll and twin angels. I mean, that wasn't in but the dream that you just had. what bothers me the most. But, yeah. I swear I've seen him before. Uh-huh. I just can't remember where. Okay. Well, that'll probably come back to me eventually. Eventually. For now, we need coffee. Let's head to the cafeteria, Zach. I hope they have some real coffee. I really need some coffee. Then we can head to the sheriff's office. There's a proper procedure for everything, right, Zack? Am I crouching? I'm stealthing, guys. Look at me stealth. Wait, does he hold his breath? Oh, is that like a feature now? I can like stealth and hold my breath? Can I do stealth kills? No, probably not. Let's be real. That'd be stupid. Oh, look, I can change this. I have my suits. I only have... Oh, the crimson suit. Perfect for work in the field. Looks almost brand new, no problem. Perfect for long hours of overtime. Crimson suit. Sometimes it's good to change your image. Almost looks brand new, no problem. Let's switch up to a crimson suit then. Yes, I would like to change, please. Thank you. 
awesome. Look at that, guys. It's great. Somebody, like, tried so hard and got so far. Oh, Jesus. You guys hear the sound design of this, by the way? Isn't it great? How there's nothing? Like, literally nothing? Am I in the mirror? Yeah, there's mirror physics. Oh. Oh. I didn't realize there's just Super Mario 64 world in there. Shit, man. Oh. Fucking hell, the sound design is so mixed up. Shall I shave today? Hmm, not bad. No, let's not. Yeah, there's beard physics in this game, guys. I bet you weren't expecting that, were you? Open. Is this just a toilet here? Yeah, it's just a toilet. Like, this room is pointless. Christ's sake. How do I open doors quickly in this game? I forget, because I tried running into the door then, but it didn't seem to work. Oh, there we go. It is whilst you run into the doors, just sometimes it doesn't work. Oh! He must be fucking, like, super quick at... Oh. Do you hear how loud that is? Like, on my headset, that's super loud. Oh, well, I said closed. I don't know why I expected. Why is this so big? Why is it so big, guy? See that flat texture? Please wake up room? Yeah, wake up the room, guys. Room! Wake up! Nah, the room's sleeping, guys. I'm gonna take a wild guess and say that any of the fucking flat textured doors I can't open. Yeah, who would've guessed it? We're just bursting into somebody else's bedroom? Apparently, yes, but nobody seems to care. Okay. Uh... Am I lost? Already? something there. Shit. I might be lost. Open. I have the feeling that I forgot something, Zach. Well, am I supposed to go this way then? That takes so long. Jesus Christ. Where the fuck am I? I just wanna... why is there like a random garden in here? What the fuck is half of this room? I have a feeling... I forgot something, Zach. So this isn't the right door either. Fuck. Ooh, Agent Honor though. <laughs> See, it was worth it, guys. We got 30 bucks of Agent Honor. Yeah, I uh... just wanted to call in, guys, and say I found this badge. Good job, York. Here's 30 bucks. Good job. Doing God's work. Why is there like random texturing on my back? It makes me look like a Minecraft character or some shit. Fuck. I can just go in. Why would I? Oh, this is my room. Okay. Let's go. Apparently that was, okay. So this is the main hall. Okay. I got a little bit lost. Just for <gasps> so that's not me. The camera automatically points up when you're going upstairs. That oh wow, I actually felt a little bit sick for a second there. I felt like I was gonna throw up. Good thing there's coffee milk here. Cause fuck, why? Ooh. That literally makes my stomach go a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. I was gonna say, how are they all out of order? Look at these vending machines. Let's have a look what's in the vending machine. You have coffee for 13... 31? Jesus Christ! 31 dollars? For a fucking... 24 dollars for a lollipop! And crackers are 35 dollars! Are you crazy? Are you fucking serious? 35 bucks for a lollipop. 25 bucks. <gasps> oh, guys. It's my favorite. 
Good morning, Mr. Morgan. Your breakfast is ready for you. Yeah. In case you guys are wonderf- wondering, the name of this song is Life is Beautiful. Thank you, Mrs. And whenever I listen Polly to it, Oxford. I can't Just help but agree. Fine. Well then. Thank you, Paul. I love the way she's doing like the stereotypical like Japanese whole drans behind you. Oh, is she gonna fucking beat me up? Is she gonna fuck me up? She's like, yes, let's get started with your is training. Everything all right, Mr. Morgan? <laughs> she's like Master Roshi. Yes, yes. I'm it's delicious, you. Polly. My compliments to the chef. I'm hoping my cooking will bring back repeat guests. No. Honestly, though, it's been a while since anyone no. has stayed here. I, I couldn't help but up. notice. Fucking hell. Aside from you and me, there seems to be no other guests or workers around. What's that? Oh my god. The salt's in that white shaker there. Thank you. I was wondering if there were any other guests How the fuck does she expect me to reach the salt in the here? middle? Oh, no. No one else. My husband and she I just expect to me to, like, place, stretch my body like Mr. Fantastic You've to the middle. You've been working here alone since then. Oh my god, what is must happening? Must be hard by yourself. Oh my. We're all out of pepper. I'm very sorry. Oh, for fuck's sake. It must be difficult to run a hotel by yourself. Well, yes, I suppose. I could just live on my pension. But I have to admit, running a hotel is kind of like a hobby of mine. That's nice. Polly, it might help to hear you better if you could sit a little closer. Look at my deck. Oh my, Mr. Morgan, you're embarrassing me. Oh, he, she really did think so. Too. I think I'm a little too old for you. Oh, Jesus. And I still love my departed husband. May God rest his soul. I appreciate the invitation, but I'm fine over here. Polly, I can hardly hear you from all the way over there. You're exaggerating. This is fine. This it's is fine. We all clumped together with such a large table in the so loud. A famous rock star once stayed in oh, the same room, sake. you know. Really? I feel honored. If you need anything, anything at all, oh just let me know. I'll help you out in any way I can barely I fucking can. hear it. Zach, the lady is offering to help. Do you want to ask her about the town? No. Uh, yeah. What is it, uh, Mr. Morgan? Just... Oh, nothing. I just said that these bacon and eggs are the very best I've ever tasted. Do you guys see oh, that? Oh, really? I you tapped the button. Again. Well, Mr. Morgan, I'd better start cleaning up. You just take it easy. I'll bring your coffee out in a moment. Thank you, Polly. I have to warn you, though. I am oh, very God, the face. particular about my coffee. Look at him. He's so evil. The very best you have, please. I understand. I'll be right back with it. Liz's face is like, mm, I'm not fucking impressed. Looks like someone tipped semen into his fucking coffee. You see that shit? He loves it. It's the way he likes it. Look with interest at my coffee. Did you guys see it? It's like the Did Lion you King. See that, Clear as a crisp spring morning. F. K. In. The coffee. Fuck! Knew I could count on it. Never fails. Now That's what the coffee said. Let's get going. God knows why. <laughs> Sorry if I scared <laughs> Oh, That's what the coffee said, though. It said it in that exact way as well. It said fuck. What the fuck? Can I not... Game. Wait. Do you guys see my finger? Do you see the finger clipping through my other fingers? Do you see it? Do you see it? Do you see what I'm talking about? You jav motherfucker! I fucking love this shit. It's great. 
coffee. Wait, can I just come here and drink more coffee? Can I look with interest? Is it going to give me more? No? Do I just drink the coffee, do I? Unexpected trouble is coming your way. Lucky item, lighter. There's always trouble heading my way in this job. What the fuck does that even mean? But I'm always up for a little excitement, too. No, not same again. I'm good. Extra fortune telling through the coffee. Fuck, man. If there was like a real life situation. What's this? Probably shouldn't try to get in there. If there was like a real life cop who like tried to. Eh, I suppose people hire fucking psychics all the time. You guys ever see that video where like. The pol uh, police station, the TV station, like, hands the psychic lady a photo and she's like, Yeah, it was a brutal pass thing. It was really awful. Like, it was terrible. I'm just gonna flash this. Oh, Jesus, that looks bad. It was so bad. She died. It was horrible. And then, like, the reporter comes on and she's like, That's a picture of me. And she's just like, Uh. Uh. Well, that's just. I just can't explain it. I don't know how that's happened. I just don't. I just don't understand. Hi, that oh, fuck. Hi. What the fuck is that noise? Ah, yes, Mr. Morgan. Fucking hell. My god. Apparently, can you imagine walking up to a woman and she opens her mouth and a fucking fire alarm just blitz out of her mouth? Just like fucking Siren Head style. I don't have much, but they may help you out. Oh fuck, and he's just as bad. So you're the sales girl too, aren't you? So you're the sales too girl, aren't you? Fucking English. Yes, that's right. Coffee comes as set with the breakfast. Don't worry, service here is just as good as any fancy city hotel. Great, thank you. Alright then, did you want something? Let's... Very well, just a moment. What do we have? Stabilizers. They restore your pulse rate. Keep it from... Keep it low for... For long. Okay. Very rare and strong brand. Cigarette heavy. Smoking them makes you forget the time going by. Fucking hell. Look how expensive everything is! $114 for a pack of cigarettes! Fucking brain stimulators for $186. I could buy a fucking PlayStation 4 for cheaper than that shit at the moment. Fucking $22 for a wedge of cheese. A whim. A whim. You want me to pay $120 for a fucking whim that you pulled out of your back garden? Is that right, Polly? Why is the whim almost as expensive as the fishing rods? I don't get it! Oh, fuck. I'm finished with you. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. You might take it easy today, okay? Can oh, I talk? Hi! Can I do for you? Let's chat. A little bit. I do a line of work, make you tired. Please lose try and relax when you're- Fucking hell, that is so overbearing. I've got some information. He calls up the station and they're just like, What'd you learn today, York? Well, apparently I need to rest and eat. Good work. Here's sixteen dollars. First day of investigation. I didn't do anything. I literally just woke up. Why did I get two hundred dollars? I just... Uh, fucking... That... Oh, it doesn't add up still. Fucking hell. Uh. It's not making any sense. I don't understand. I'm just getting money. Look, you're getting money. Shut up. We're paying you for your job, York. That's all you have to worry about. Look at the pickle. Funniest shit I ever seen. Turn himself into a pickle. And then he drew the pickle in MS Paint. Funniest shit I ever seen. A police car. You see him go fucking full truth or day mode there. You guys seen that movie Truth or Day where he does the big stupid smile? Her office is open from 9 till 5. Don't be late. Chef George Woodman. So we have King George to thank for preparing a car for me. A pleasant surprise, eh, Zach? Let's take it for a spin. Let's take it for a drive oh. Da da da! I 
have to tell you, Zack, this place simply amazes me. The keys were left on the front hood, and nobody stole the car. Yeah, no one stole the police Values. car. This town has what the That was an unusually needs. long... Sp Values. What the fuck? He was, like, thinking Let's about it. Let's head over to the sheriff's department. He's like, why would nobody steal this... Oh, fucking hell. Look at this shit. Have you noticed that, like, pretty much all of these don't make sense? I can barely tell what that's supposed to be. I got the master key. And I also got the flare. Might need a couple of those. Oh, fuck. How do I change the aspect ratio? I like it. Nope, that's not it. What the fuck? No, that's not what I wanted! Is he gonna get out of the car now? Fuck! I should've- Zach, is there something here that you want to check out? No! We're supposed to go through Anna Graham's file at the sheriff's office, but if you want to act on a hunch, then I'm with you. Do you just say Anna Graham? Hey! There we go! Ooh. Oh, look how good this controls, guys. Oh my god! Oh my god, I can't even describe. Remember I was talking about tank controls before? Fuck. Fucking hell. Oh my god. I can't. I can't. I physically cannot turn. Where am I even going? Well, fuck, I forgot. This is as far as I zoom. Well, I want to go there. That's the mission. Get the investigation files regarding the victim anagram. Anagram. But which way do I need to go? Video game? This way. Turn down. Well, let's go then. Nothing's happening. Okay. We've got 97% fuel, guys. I think we're Gucci. I'm not even barely touching this. It's like, this is me tapping it. Oh fuck, I forgot my turning. No! I'm getting too upset by the control. Oh, Jesus. I'm getting upset by the controls. Like, this is me tapping it. You see how much, like, it veers? Right. From the moment I touch it, I'm gonna show you how- And it, like, you'll hear the click of me, like, Hit in the side of the controller to know how much I'm. It, how terrible this is. You ready for this? Look at that. That's barely even a turn radius. The shit controls like ass. I have to like slow that. Oh fuck. No. Ah. No, I want to do this. Please. I almost did it too. Do you think he designed the road that way on purpose so that people could turn? Specifically just so people could turn the corners? Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh Jesus. Ah shit. So Zach, about those bonus features in DVDs nowadays. What? You know the ones from the 80s have almost no bonus material. Nope. Even if they do, it's a trailer and the visual quality is pretty bad. Well that visual quality... Zach, we're here. Oh! Let's continue our chat later. Oh fuck, it sounded like the, the car dot EXE had crashed for a second there. Oh fucking hell, look how bad that is. This beard's all just shat feathers. Building for such a small town. You see that shit? The exterior would look as spectacular. Wow. I need to change the fucking sound on this game. I barely hear people talking. Look at that whim. It was green. It's fucking green for some reason. You ready for this guy? That's aged well. Pleasure to meet you, Agent Morgan. We've been expecting you. I'm Thomas McLean, the sheriff's assistant. Now, you guys get three guesses as to what his sexual orientation might be. 
FBI and special the first two don't Francis count. York Morgan. Please just call me York. It's what everyone else calls me. Whatever. Very else well me. then, Agent Agent York. Yeah, I believe Agent, I owe Agent you York. a thank you for retrieving my belongings from my car. Thanks. I owe you a thanks. So uh. No, no. Just doing my job. Thanks. I just. Yeah. No. I want to help do everything I can to help the investigation. I just can't believe Anna was murdered. Yeah, Anna Graham. She was such a bright and lovely girl. Did you know her well? Those shiny eyes. He's a fucking demon or some shit. No, not really. This is still shining all town. the way from over here. I'm sorry. It's just that this is the first really big case I've ever seen. I understand. Just try to relax. Can I have a look at Anna's file now? Y yes, of course. The sheriff told me to let you through to the meeting room. Okay. But I've lost the key to the cabinet where the files are. Okay. Why don't you take a look around while I go look for it? Okay. Let me know when things are ready. Look, uh, listen to this. Look at him go! Zach Thomas appears to be the kind and sensitive type. Yes. Totally at odds with the monarch. Almost a good setting for a cartoon. Yeah, it's almost like a good setting for a video game, eh? Right, I'm gonna fucking... Which one's the profile option? Option! There's only one, though. There's only one option. Uh, sound. Let's... That's the sound effect, background music. Let's turn you down just a little bit to there. And hope that it doesn't overpower the fucking dialogue a second. Yes, I want them to be reflected now. Wait, did you just say that we saved at my next save point? So the settings aren't even saved now until I save the game. How the fuck did I never notice that before? Because I never mess with the settings, I guess, in the video game. By the way, do you like the way my hand was clipping through that phone? Yeah, me too. I loved it. It's good. Oh. Right, I think Thomas is chilling in here, right? Right? No? Oh no, this is the workout. Look at that iron body. Long-tailed flying squirrel key. Which key does he even fucking need? I don't even remember. That oh, is fucking nothing. I thought that was the Hulk for a second then. That would've been cool if it was just a random picture of the Hulk, eh? Where the fuck is Thomas? These random police peoples. This person probably has nothing to do with the investigation. How do you know? How can you say that with such clairvoyance? There's nothing to do with it. Where's Thomas? He's in the wall, apparently. He's in the material room. Isn't material just another word for stuff? The stuff room. Right, what do you need? I really can't seem to find that key. What should I do? Sheriff isn't gonna be happy. It has a sudden flying squirrel key holder attached to it. You haven't seen it, have you? No, I haven't actually. What happens if I turn this on? This is just... Oh. It does nothing. Good to know. Let's put it back then. Thank you for making that gross noise as well. That went right into my ear hole and I didn't like it. Ugh. Oh. Okay. Right, let's go get the f southern fucking s flying squirrel key or whatever the fuck it's called. I think it's down. Oh, fuck, it's doing the thing again where I have to navigate with the tank controls. Shit. Awesome. I nailed it that time. You see how good? That was, guys. I did it. It was me. Right, is there a key lying around here? Is that, or is that just me? Striped squirrel key. Might be this one, if I remember correctly. I think it's this one? If it's not, then it's the one in the uh, cell block, which is this way, eh? You guys gonna buzz me in? No, I'm too strong. Boom! Just break through the locks. That guy's just like so scared that he can't even move. He 
probably has nothing to do with the investigation anyway. So whatever. Do I just... Yeah, I can sidestep with the bumpers. That's cool. I remember this dog. That dog probably did something sick. Now the dog's wanted, apparently. See that guy's the dog's wanted. Right, is there a key lying around? Of the southern flying kind? Well, that's a sleepy bed. That's also a sleepy bed. I can just sleep in the cells if I want to, guys. Hopefully we'll be bringing in culprits soon. That'll mean a little- it'll mean an end to our little vacation. Well, I believe in capital punishments. No, I'm joking. Uh, is it in here? It might be in here, you know. Someone went fucking nuts in here, apparently. Ah, there we go. Curly tailed flying squirrel keys. So it might be this one, actually. So he's gonna, like, here's something that you're probably gonna notice. Let's just let him go. No? Okay. No saying free the prisoners. But I'm in charge. Nah, I'm not in charge. George is still in charge. I mean, I'm. I have no experience with Brit uh, American law, but I'm pretty sure an FBI agent can just let people go, right? He can just be like, yes, you are fine. I am Special Agent Francis York Morgan. And I have decided that you are innocent. And you may go. Well, Emily's chilling. Is Emily chilling in here now? As well? Hey, Emily. Oh! What are you doing? Are you doing the animation there? Okay. Bye, Emily. Good to see you, I guess. Agent York, did you find the key? I think it's that one? Is this the key? You found the key? Yes. That's the right one? Yes, a southern flying squirrel. Yes. Thank you so much. Obviously. I'll bring the files right in, so please go to the meeting room. Yee. Okay, I'll be waiting for you. Well, Zach, we just got here, and we've cracked a big case already. Yeah, just salute to me. You found the key. What a fucking soldier. The victim's name was Anna Graham. On a ground. Age 18, she just recently this graduated music is still from high school fucking liars. Her dream was to move out to the city and become a model. But for the time being, oh she was God. working in the a and diner here in town. She lived with her mother, Sally. Fuck. On his father you guys died hear that? in an accident. Just no suddenly got though, super loud when we were in her face. And I was trailing off as we go, what the fuck is happening? Her mother is unemployed. So? And lives on the insurance money from her husband's accident. Well, black kids. Looks upset. After all, it's a small town with a low cost of living. Financially, they seem to get by fine, and they led normal lives. A normal life is exactly what a curious teenager doesn't want. It's all starting to make sense, Zach. Yeah, exactly. This kid's ungrateful as shit. Yeah, just put it out on my fingers. City folk, huh? No. No, I take that back. All of them can't be as bad as him. And some should have better manners. Huh. This is a good biscuit. I've never tasted a biscuit this delicious. Where in town can I get these? Well, actually... I... Well... I... I baked them myself. Really, Thomas? You, the flamboyant. It's amazing. Uh, what are you doing in law how do we want to wear this? Very Let's just say flamboyant fella the is the one who made the milk biscuit, yeah? The baking. Oh my. Agent Morgan, the autopsy's ready. That was really you important to the story to though, guys. to the Greenvale General Hospital. Emily, you come too. Thomas, stay here and tidy up these files. Y yes, sir. We're going to use the car outside. Let's get going. You might think this is just a small town police investigation. But our inspections are thorough and solid. I'm hoping you won't slow us down. No, I'm just gonna eat my biscuit. Let him reason it slowly! He's like, I want this biscuit. Oh, Jesus. We're getting paid again, guys. Our daily salary. Three times today, we've had our daily salary. 
I didn't even go in that room, did I? Why is my money so much too? I don't get it. What? That's the fund's total amount. I get it, but I still don't think that's adding up properly. Oh, fucking hell. Yeah, saving my game. Thank you.